Commanders, welcome to the major enlisted update, New Era. Throughout 2023, we've done our best to bring this day as close as possible. Together, with your help and suggestions, we've worked hard to merge all of the game's different campaigns into one cohesive whole. And now, we are proud to present the first update in this new format. The main feature of this update will be the new infantry squads, which will join the battle impressively on their own transport vehicles. This is both convenient and practical. No need to run on your own. To transport soldiers to the battlefield, you will be able to use both regular trucks and armored vehicles, protected from small arms fire and equipped with additional weapons. Additionally, these new combat vehicles will be able to give allied squads a ride to the target. Thus, a new, alternative way of spawning infantry will appear in the game. When selecting a respawn point, simply find a free vehicle ready to take passengers. The update will introduce a new location inspired by the events of the Ardenne Offensive. The battles in the famous Hurtgen Forest and on the Ardenne Bulge took place from 1944 to 1945 and ended with the defeat of the German army. However, the victory cost the Allied forces dearly. Historians call the Battle of the Bulge the bloodiest single battle of the American troops in both World War II and in the history of the United States of America. New Era is the first major update to the game after merging the campaigns and transitioning to a new economy. As you're well aware, Commanders, we've left behind the need to unlock, level up, and upgrade squads for each theater of war every time. Now, soldiers from all four armies represented in the game can participate in a variety of battles involving their country. Notably, squads from the U.S. Army and from the German Army will be able to participate in the battles of the new Ardennes Campaign. You won't have to start the war with a simple rifle in your hands this time. When merging campaigns, we took special care to maintain the balance of forces. For example, the Soviet Army lacked paratroopers, so we added them. The updated matchmaker creates battles taking into account the strength of your weapons and vehicles. We plan to regularly adjust the battle ratings based on our statistics and your feedback too. The Japanese army is especially lucky, as there will be several new squads with weapons designed to compete with their allied counterparts. Small but pleasant changes are waiting for you in the battle reward system. We have added additional battle points for successful long-range kills with firearms. And we have also added an additional award for the best engineers to the battle results. Justice will finally prevail. On top of the usual award for eliminating enemy infantry, we've created an award for constructing buildings that benefit the team. Check out the full list of new features and improvements on our website or directly in-game. Redesigned locations in Berlin, a lot of AI improvements, improved sound and special effects, and many more. See you in battle.